That is huge. My glasses on so your girl can see, and I'm still a baddie, period. It's so cute! You can't just put stuff on your vision board and then expect it just to magically happen. Like, you gotta work towards it, so. Yeah, I had two readers. Let me think, I guess it's my turn. It was definitely a little rusty and horrible in the beginning, but. Yeah! <laughs> I can make your bed I'm on my way to the car dealership as y'all saw in my last vlog my tire is flat so my appointment is at seven o'clock it's literally seven o'clock right now but i don't stay far from the dealership so that's why i'm running a little behind plus i'm tired i didn't go to sleep till like one o'clock i was up cleaning all day yesterday that'll be like a TikTok. i didn't record me deep cleaning or anything because you know i just did really i just did two deep cleans within like two months so that's kind of like overkill deep clean so i decided just to record it for tiktok and kind of move my stuff to tiktok now to try to get my tiktok following up but if you're new here hey girl my name is akira janae don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave it's going to be the start of another weekly vlog today is monday like i said i didn't vlog yesterday because i was just cleaning watching the super bowl waiting on usher to perform all of that good jazz and i mean i really couldn't do anything because i do have a spare tire on my car um and yeah my tire he told me on friday that it was going to be like 230 40 50 dollars my last tire was like 230 you know with tax like 250 um so i'm just expecting to pay that um my last tire i did actually like finance it through them so i think i'm just going to finance them again i should have checked my battery but my battery is about to die i'll probably get some quick little phone footage or whatever but just wanted to introduce the vlog and tell y'all what's going on early this morning i'm tired as hell literally got up washed my face brushed my teeth i didn't even took prints out or anything and literally on my way to the car dealership so i'm almost there i'm like two minutes away oh girl being an adult is so ghetto like no lie <laughs> but i'll talk to y'all when i leave about here and get home because my battery's about to die hey y'all got a little haul for you guys it's 11 21 i ate mcdonald's breakfast i went and got my tire replaced my tire the whole thing was like 280 something dollars the tire was 220 but you know they cost to put it on and all that other jazz so that was 280 dollars today as well as i went to McDonald's to get some breakfast. I went to Michael's, I went to Walmart, and that's it. So, from Walmart, we're gonna get into that. I got a grocery pickup over there in the back, and then I went inside as I was walking inside Walmart. I saw these meal prep containers, a pack of 10 for like $4 and something. Um, I don't need any more, you guys know, I already got enough of these, but my boyfriend was talking about how he wanted to actually get into meal prep obviously everything i do he do <laughs> y'all know how they go like whatever the women do the man usually will start to catch on and start doing that too whether that's like skincare uh stuff with like decor all of that he he just whatever i do he'll end up doing too <laughs> so that's good though since he was talking about meal prep and i got him a pack of 10 meal prep containers um valentine's day is this wednesday today is monday february 12th so I'm gonna make him a cute little Valentine's Day like basket, if you will. And since we just had Christmas and his birthday, I know I just got him like a watch, cologne. We went to all of that stuff. For Valentine's Day, I know I was mostly about the woman. I still like to do like a little gift basket just with like cool little fun goodies and snacks and stuff. So since he did talk about meal prepping, this is gonna be inside of his Valentine's Day basket. Um, I have a ring doorbell coming for him and i have this little like money saving box thing whatever so oh, excuse me 
I did want to do the little five senses thing to have him open each gift as like, you know, hear and touch and all of that sight. Um, but I don't know. I think I may just do a basket and just put all of the stuff in there. Cause it's like, when you do a basket, everything is kind of like front and center. Whereas if I wanted to do the little five senses gift, gift little set he'll open each individual gift like five gifts separately but i think i'm just going to do the little gift basket and put everything in there okay so the other two things i got from walmart that i actually went inside for is going to be the things that i went to michael's for like they're going to go together so i got this three pack of putty knives you guys can probably already see where i'm going with this obviously it's going to be in the description and i got this dry decks um lightweight um joint compound stuff to be able to do this little diy canvas so this is from walmart <clears throat> this is from walmart it was pretty cheap got some groceries i'll probably put that up on the screen or do like a full i'll probably put the groceries up on the screen i'm not going to do like a full grocery haul this is the bread that he gave me though so i got hamburger buns hot dog buns and some more bread and then my groceries are over there we'll unpack that in a second the bag that i got from michael's my michael's total was like 67 dollars and that's with my 30 percent off coupon that they had going on i know michael's always got a sale but i have not been inside michael's in a while and girl they had every like everything on sale um i'm not sure if that's like a everyday thing but i know they always got it every day of the week they got a coupon you can use but as far as everything in that store being on sale girl that's insane so yeah i spent 67 dollars and it was like 70 something dollars total i saved 44. so i bought this three piece set of flat brushes for this little diy that i'm about to do i bought a six pack of the large plastic knives um the plastic ones was obviously cheaper than the actual metal ones so we got a six pack of those and i was just walking around and i saw this it's a snap and spray um i got this from raven elise she loved to use these and y'all know i'm the spray painting queen okay so i decided to invest in one of these to make it easier to actually just spray paint so i don't gotta you know stand that close to it and it, the application looks better with the gun anyway then i got this little easy cleanup tool brush or whatever for this little project that i'm trying to do Oh, I forgot to look for the big one of that. And then I got three different colors of paint. I got black, I got white, and then I got a smaller thing of this uh, brown color. It's in the color Fawn. And I think this will be really cute to match in with my placemats and kind of bringing in that brown and neutral tones in um, because I am trying to look for some like brown tan pillowcases to match this. And then the last thing that I got from uh, the small thing that I got from Michaels is this little bitty um sewing set super cute i had got one of these like when i was in high school um the only reason honestly why i got this is because it is uh, measuring tape tape measure i need that to measure my waist um when i was doing the chloe ting challenge i wanted to measure my waist before and after not even gonna lie i'm gonna have to restart it again so i'm gonna restart it today <laughs> on day like seven i like skipped a day and then it just went downhill from then but I'm gonna try to stay committed. I mean, I can finish it for the month of February. So I'm gonna start day one again today and actually measure myself so I can actually see the results happening. And this just comes with safety pins. It got a new little pair of scissors. I love those little bitty um, scissors because I like to use it to cut out my sew in. So yeah, it's just, I mean, all of this stuff I can use, I decided to get that. Now, the big thing that I got from Michaels is obviously the canvas. So, the size canvas that i actually got is a 30 by 40 and girl this is huge this particular brand at michael's is on sale buy one get one free free okay the exact same size or smaller you get for free so i'm like if i get the same size for free why would i get a small one you know unless like you really just need a small one but i'm like if you buy a big canvas, like, I might as well just get another big one. So, I got two of these big canvases. Ooh. My plan for this is to put over here. Turn y'all this way. So, y'all see where my little picture frame is? I wanted to put this one 
right here. And I got like the perfect size. They had one that was a little bit bigger than this that I was thinking about getting. But I'm like, I don't think my little wall is that big. And I don't want the canvas to take up the entire wall. So I think this is really nice. I think I'm going to put it about right here. That is huge. So I'm going to put that right there. And then I'm like, okay, well, I have another, ooh, I have another canvas. Where the hell am I about to put this one at? So as you can see, I got a little bitty hallway right here. Um, I got a box right here, but I was like, okay, I can maybe put this one over here, but I feel like that's like really huge. Then I'm thinking, hmm, where else could I put a canvas, girl? Why did I put this up in my room? I think I'm going to put it in my room. Y'all know I said I didn't want no canvas, but I think this may solve my problem and solution. Let's turn on the light a little bit. Okay. I can go back to Michael's and get another one, and then I will be able to obviously buy one, get one free. I may buy like a smaller one to um, practice on because I don't really want to mess up the big one. So that's huge. My thought process for this is I want a canvas in here because you can't really tell right now, but I probably popped in a video. There's a little bitty square piece at the top that when I record a video, it turns up a different color right there at the top. So this big old canvas actually covers this little square piece up here so I can put it like this and then it'll cover most of that um, mismatch square piece. So if I put this one up right here, and then the other one up. I think that'd be really, really nice. Um, it's just, I don't know what color I would want to paint the canvas. Obviously, I want to do, obviously, my wall is black. So I can't have it all black because I just don't want those vibes. So I was thinking of maybe bringing in this emerald green color a little bit more. I know y'all gonna say gold. I don't really want gold here because everything in here is black white and silver besides this is gold right here and i really wish it wasn't gold but i think i may just do hmm. i may do it black i don't know i'm gonna have to look up some inspo on pinterest because i already did inspo for my living room canvas feeding him the farmer's dog for how many days i think we're on day like four of the transition and as you can see <laughs> he literally leaves the kibble in there now so i put the soft food on top of the kibble he eats some of the kibble but i mean literally he's leaving it all there so they were on day four of prince feeding guy transition i did 50 and 50 again yesterday i did 50 50 Tomorrow is going to be 75% farmer's dog and 25% old food. And then another one of those. And then day seven. So Tuesday, Wednesday. So by Thursday, he'll be 100% on the farmer's dog. Here, I'm over there walking. <laughs> and yeah, so he's liking it. He's transitioned pretty well. Um, for those of you who also have a Yorkie, Morky, Maltese, whatever, with a little sensitive, messed up stomach like Prince, to let y'all know he's been doing really well so if you want to try it definitely recommend it like i said this ain't sponsored this is 140 dollars of my hard earned money <laughs> but you got another beef then i'm going to feed him turkey no i'm going to feed him chicken and then i'm going to feed him the turkey one or maybe turkey i don't know we'll see um but yeah he's liking it and um i can't wait to see like the benefits and stuff in him people been saying that they see like more energy in their dog their coat looks better just overall 10 out of 10 across the board um so yeah he got a lot of energy regardless but you know i'm excited he likes it and now he's looking at me like girl what you talking about <laughs> boo 
All right, I'm about to put these groceries in and I'm about to lay down for like an hour or two. It's 11.45 because yeah, I need a little nap or a little rest. So this is much later in the day. I decided to go ahead and start on my DIY canvas. I went ahead and used a trash bag to kind of outline the perimeter of the canvas. Then I'm like, hold up girl, I can just use the packaging that came with the canvas and you know, use, yeah, yeah, okay. Women in STEM, yeah, I know. <laughs> Cut off the excess, put it at the bottom of the canvas so I don't get anything on my hardwood floor, which I still ended up getting a little bit on the hardwood floor. I got my iPad out to look at the design that I was going for. Um, since I am using my phone and camera to record, I couldn't use my phone for that. So I'm using my iPad. It was a little weird to do this because this is my first ever like DIY project like this. It took a minute for me to actually get all of this stuff on the canvas and spread it out. I was a little bit confused, but after a while I got the hang of it. Once I actually put it on the canvas, I just gotta use that little like spatula thing to really just slide it on there and that made it a lot easier. I opted to get the one that goes on pink and dries white just obviously simply because I will know when it's dry. Um, and a lot of people used to talk about the canvas like the canvas cracking after it dries if you use the one that's from the Michael store um yeah so I really enjoyed doing this it was a really smooth process I used my little bitty plastic little spatulas from Michael's to kind of smooth it in a little bit more and it worked out really nicely Okay, so I'm done. I don't know how long it took. I'm gonna have to look on my camera. Let's see how long it took me. I got done about 10, 15 minutes ago and I started recording <coughs> at 7, 12. So it took a little bit longer because I was recording. I didn't actually start working on this until 7, 24 it says. And it's 8, 44. So it took about an hour to do, not too bad. Now that I know how to actually do it um, for the next canvas, or I'm gonna put the other one in my bedroom when I do that one, that one's probably gonna take no more than like 30 minutes or so because it's not gonna be as complicated as this design right here I was trying to do. I like everything on here. I'm excited to see it dry. I got a lot of textures and stuff like that. Um, this one right here, I was gonna actually like swivel down, but I think I like it like that. So I need to see when it dries and how I want to paint it, but right now I like it. I used a <coughs> full thing of this stuff. Um, definitely had to make it spread because really I needed some more because I wanted like a lot of texture on here. So for my other one, tomorrow I'm gonna buy like two more of these things because I do have another big one to do. And then I plan to do another like smaller one as well. So. Actually, no, I'm gonna have to buy like three of those because I need two of these for my bedroom. So I'm gonna buy, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, anyways, I need to dry this somewhere and um, I don't wanna put it outside because it's been raining and I would hate for this to get wet. So I think I'm just gonna set it up over there against that wall um, for right now. Cause I was gonna put it in my guest room, but I do need to clean up my guest room. So we'll just say that. I'm gonna let her dry for 24 hours and then I'll probably come paint it on maybe tomorrow night if I feel up to it or it may just save the painting for Thursday. So it's literally like 11 16 at night by this point and I just got the urge to start cleaning so I decided to take out all of this stuff out of my guest bathroom closet because it actually did need to be organized and cleaned again so I just decided to do that because I was honestly girl tired of looking at it so that's what I did and we're gonna do a little bitty mini like clean with me I just had the urge to like just get my house back in order at midnight dang there. <laughs> Just annoying me, and I'm too about it. And the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil, and I grew about it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it. Big wheels keep rolling, rolling. I'm outside, 29, G5, Seaside. I've been losing friends and finding peace. But honestly, that sounds like a fair trade to me if I ever heard one, and I'm still here outside. Frontline. Southside, I've 
love and losing friends and finding peace. Honestly, that sound like a fair trade to me. Look, don't invite me over if you go another pretty party. Looking back. Hey y'all, good morning. It's 11.25. It is the day before Valentine's Day, so the 13th of February. Um, I just got my nails done. I decided to do oval. I was talking to y'all on the vlog about last week or so. The sun is shining like really, really hard. But, girl, it's not focusing now. Come on now. Anyways, I got, well, they're called almond. Let me correct that because Janae kept correcting me. She had got almond as well, but I don't really like them. So I'll probably go back and get them changed, but I am on a time crunch today because this is way too thick. Like that's ugly as hell. I want it to be a lot thinner and I feel like this hand is thicker than this hand. Um, it's funny because Chelsea, <laughs> Chelsea Janelle on YouTube, she was just talking about how she wanted hers thin and the girl didn't do her French tip thin. And I'm like, now I see what she mean. Like I just cannot, like I can't do the thick French tip. Like we're, we're not in that era anymore, girl. So, um, my girl Tracy, she did my nails, but she went back to the back and let another guy paint my nails. So I'll probably go back. I mean, it'll be a, it'll be fine for two weeks. When I go back, I'm gonna tell her like, no, you about to paint my nails. Like I don't need nobody else doing my nails but you. So I'm about to go. Like I said, it's 11:27. Bay is down here. He got off work this morning. Came down here. Um, I think he's trying to surprise me or something at the house. So I didn't like look at the doorbell or anything like that. I didn't check anything to be surprised. But basically, I dropped Prince off at the groomers at 9. Well, 9:40 because I was late. And basically now I'm just waiting to go home. Um, he said give give him some time. So I went and got my nails done because I needed them done. Um, I gotta pick prints up when they say he's done. He said three to four hours, but I hope it's like two, maybe two and a half. Like he needs to be done by like 12:30 because Bay just takes me and said that the first place we're going today, we gotta be there by three o'clock. So I'm like, mm -hmm. what do you have up your sleeve that we gotta be somewhere by three o'clock? Okay, so he said the first place that we're going, we gotta be there by three o'clock. The lighting is just not doing it for me right here. He said we gotta be there by three o'clock and it's 11:30, and i still gotta go to dollar tree to get like his basket to put his gifts in his gifts just got delivered today i got him a amazon uh ring doorbell camera he's been wanting that and then something else and i gotta go to the dollar store to get the basket and you know little cute stuff and the snacks and i was gonna go to target real quick as well um to pick up some more underwear for him the underwear that he likes from there because he was like he was running all his underwear is basically in my house and he ain't got nothing left in his house so i was gonna give him some more underwear and i mean that's really it i just got him cologne for christmas and his birthday last week and like a whole bunch of stuff so y'all know valentine's day is mostly for the girlies anyway so the girls usually do like a cute little like valentine's day basket so that's what i'm about to go do and i'll talk to y'all when i get to dollar tree i think i need to just go ahead and go there first i need to pee really bad as well and i have not ate he said he was going to cook me breakfast this morning is why i didn't get any food but i guess he's i mean obviously i would be tired too he just worked um like i ate well like anyways he got off work this morning so i know he's tired so he said he's gonna cook me breakfast tomorrow for like valentine's day or whatever and today i know we are going to dinner somewhere in little rock as well as whatever we got to do at three o'clock so yeah, I'm excited. I love Valentine's Day. I what am I reading? Just open it. It's got. <laughs> That's what we're gonna be ready to go to. This is the upcoming reservation. I am dead. <laughs> Three to five. So what we? Okay. Okay. Did they give you this? No. Or you just not. printed it? Okay. Hello. <laughs> okay, so top golf. Yeah. Three to five. And then Sonny. <gasps> I wanted to go here. No, that's today. That's what we're doing today. That's what we're doing today. It's 645. Okay, so they give a little time between five and six. Uh -huh. Okay, so that's why you said don't go to wear no dress. Oh, babe. That's, that's tomorrow. That's the, this tomorrow. tomorrow? Yeah, I'm going to be tired, so I'm going to get my oil change and take a nap. <laughs> what, tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow. Oh, that's fine. <laughs>
and hot streaks. Not, not he got the whole, <laughs> the whole itinerary. <laughs> and then the, <laughs> he is so cute. <laughs> he didn't put the whole plans in a little folder, y'all. Here he is. I had time to decorate. I had to do this work. This is cute. <laughs> what made you come up with this idea? I right, just on the fly. <laughs> That is so cute. I'm gonna take a picture. <laughs> I'm gonna do a little four by four. You ain't got no information on here, do you now? Oh, that's cute. Okay, so cool. I'll just wear some sneakers, probably. Sneakers, yeah, because I mean, I can change. I'm gonna change too. So, do I wanna do my makeup now or wait? Okay, so I'm about to make his gift basket because he wants his stuff now. <laughs> um, hold on. As y'all can hear, the fire alarm is freaking going off because they're coming to inspect our buildings this week and they're just, it's so annoying. It's off. No, it's still on. It's on, but it kind of went off a little bit. They're checking the alarms basically and they're about to check our apartment buildings like come inspect our apartment. I hate that. Um, they're going to change the air filters as well, which is cool. My last apartment, they just came to change air filters like the maintenance guy and then they just left. They didn't have to inspect an apartment and I hate that because I don't want nobody walking in my house with no shoes on and I know they're going to have any dirty shoes on. Then it's probably going to be two or three people with them and that is just so annoying to me. Like I hate when apartments have to come check apartments like uh so annoying like i do not want all y'all in my apartment so i'm about to make his basket real quick and put his stuff in here this basket did tear a little bit but i mean it's fine this is probably going to go in the trash anyway that's why i didn't even say anything to her and she was taking forever to check me out as well prince he is all in the stuff he got a haircut today too obviously like i told y'all You in the way, move. <laughs> they can't even see because you in the way. <laughs> I should have got a bigger basket. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. 
doesn't mean anything. Okay, thank you. That was a good one. That was a good one. We left Top Golf. We had like maybe <clears throat> maybe about like 20 minutes, 18, 20 minutes left on our lane. But we went ahead and left because we do gotta get ready for dinner tonight. So it is 5:53, and our reservation it says in the little folder that he made <laughs> for our little itinerary. Our dinner says 6:45 at Sony Williams Steakhouse. Uh, I've been wanting to eat there, and then yeah, tomorrow we got our reservation and then stuff like that. So Top Golf was amazing. It was super fun. Um, we was definitely a little rusty and horrible in the beginning, but at the end he started he started to do really really good at the end, and I did really well too. So I like it. It's fun. He said we're gonna go back um, soon or whatever. That's gonna be like our little next little spot. Uh, drunk bowling and drunk top golf is what we gonna do. <laughs> So our next little couples outing thing is gonna be a top golf. So I had so much fun. Like that was so so fun. I'm gonna take him out. Um, I am about to shower since we've been basically outside at top golf before I go to dinner. Um, since we gotta be there at 6:45, we're probably gonna leave out by like 6:15. So I really got like an hour, an hour to do my makeup and about 10-15 minutes to try to find something to wear. I know I'm gonna wear a dress. I just don't know which dress yet, but it shouldn't be too hard just to figure out a dress that I want to wear. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a little peek real quick for the thumbnail just in case I may need a picture in this. Um, but yeah, super exciting. My flowers, I'll probably take some pictures of my flowers today, but I'm definitely going to take pictures with those flowers tomorrow. Um, I got a peek as well. I'm trying to talk really quickly. And then he's standing by the door, so that means that he needs to go outside. Y'all know I switched him over to the farmer's dog. So since that food is soft food, it runs through, you know, through dogs a little bit quicker. So after I pee, I'm going to go ahead and take him down real quick. And then I'm going to come back, shower, do my makeup. And then I just got to be ready by 6.15. So about an hour and 15 minutes to do that. And I'll check back in with y'all. When I get ready, I need to make sure both my batteries charged up for tonight. Okay. Makeup is complete. I had about 30 35 minutes to do my makeup it is 5 54 we're trying to leave the house by 6 15 so i am about to try to find me something to wear real quick um lighting is not doing me justice right now but this is just a quick little natural little natural everyday beat tomorrow i actually have enough time to actually do everything that i want to do okay so i need something to wear like real bad hey 5 55 I do have this. It's pink. It's on theme for Valentine's Day. Um, since I've been wearing pink already today, trying to fix my robe. This one she in. Um, it got lighting and stuff in there already. I can get a cute little pink in this. So I think I'm gonna wear this. We think what we think. All right, let's get another choice. Let's get another choice. We can <laughs> either that or this all white dress. And then if I wear this all white, so it's long sleeve. It is 59 degrees, so it's kind of getting a little chilly outside. The sun going down and stuff. I'm gonna 
cinches in in the waist so i think this is really cute if i wear this i'm gonna wear green with it green heels and then a green bag Where's the bag the place says business casual Ooh. it says business casual so i'll wear the green purse and some heels and then with this or i can do the uh pink which is really cute let's just try them let's just try them You like it? All right, I'm gonna show you another one after this one. This is the white one. Accidentally got a little bit of makeup on me. I like it cause it's long sleeve. Okay, so got bag, got shoes. We working with, real cute, real cute. Gonna have it. I need to get this stain out real quick. We're gonna use this, see if it'll work. Ooh, don't run down, don't run down, don't run down. You know what, I really could have just Photoshopped it white. Yeah, I forgot about that. That's what we gonna do, let's Photoshop it white. So I got makeup, hair, everything done, dressed within an hour. My purse, I'm about to go pack that. And then my heels, I'm not gonna put on until we about to walk outside the door. Um, I think that's pretty much it. My battery's charged. I'm doing I'm doing real good today. Um, I'm excited to eat. I really want some lamb chops, but since we are going to like a steakhouse, I kind of want to get a steak. But we'll see what the menu looking like and what I want. Don't know why I'm whispering because I'm in my own house, but girl, your girl did real good for a little hour B and get ready with me, okay? <sighs> Let's go put, oh. <laughs> Let's oil up these legs and I'm ready to go. 18? What's up? Ryan? What time? Oh, no. 27?
Hey y'all, it's Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. It's 4.13 in the evening right now. Um, we've been out at Target. We went to get breakfast this morning. I didn't take my camera because I didn't think we were gonna do, like, go get breakfast or anything. I'll probably pop in like a boomerang or something, but it's a place that I've been to multiple times. It's always really good. Um, big bad breakfast, something like that, BBB. Um, so yeah, I wanted to show y'all my painting. I do need to get ready right now. Our reservation is at 6.45 and the place we're going to is 50 minutes away. Right now, since it's traffic, it's staying about like almost an hour away. So we do need to be leaving out by like 5.20, 5.30. Five maybe at the very latest. Um, it is 4.13. So I did wash and shampoo condition my hair and all of that. And added some more concealer to my part. Wash my baby hairs, all of that jazz to have my hair looking really good because I wanted to wear the dress that we were supposed to, that I was supposed to wear in our photo shoot. If you guys saw that vlog and our pictures and stuff. It's this dress from Opali. Uh, that's a hundred, you know, Opali high. So I paid, I just cleaned off my counter stuff too. I literally paid a hundred and 30 something dollars. It's supposed to be beige. I mean, it's kind of giving like blush pink beige to me. It's not really beige. So that's why I didn't wear it because it, it wasn't like brown enough, but literally still have the tags on it. And I was going to wear this since we're going to like this little fancy, nice little restaurant. And I think they got stairs in the restaurant. So I'll be able to take really, really nice pics. It's literally just like the dress that I wore on my birthday. It's just a longer version and it has a slit in the front with the back out. So it's the same type of material. It's just a different like design. So um, I wanted to actually get like really good professional, not really professional, but like I wanted to get really, really good pictures in that, like with my camera and everything. So we're gonna see if I can get ready in time and then I'll wear that one. If I don't wear that, I'll probably keep that for some other like special occasion. Um, the only other dress or something that I would plan on wearing, this is like a skirt with the half shoulder thing going on. I already wore this one last year. I do need to probably sell that. Um, I don't wear this one anymore. I keep it. This is what I wore to my sister's funeral. Haven't taken out the little breast cancer thing or whatever. So I just like to keep that here because I mean... He just feels like I have a piece of her with me. I wore that to the funeral. We all was supposed to wear the pink. Like I already wore half of all of this stuff. I don't really want to wear red. Um, so yeah, these are my shorter dresses. Like I already wore that. I don't really have anything else to put on, I don't think. Uh. I wore that for my birthday. I have this, but I don't like the way that looks. So yeah, I think that's really all I got. So these are my three choices. Yeah, I know I got that pink dress that I tried on for y'all yesterday. I don't want to wear that because it is going to get cold tonight. And we are going to the casino after dinner. So that's why I didn't really want to wear this one per se, because I mean, it has a little weight to it. And if we're going to the casino, like this is just, a, <laughs> this is kind of just like a going out dress, take pictures, cute, okay, cool, sit down and take off. These two, whereas is more, you know, walk around in, and this one is actually going to keep me warm. Like I wouldn't have to wear a jacket or anything like that because it just this material this is these are all from Shein except for that one so it just feels really nice so when I do my hair and makeup I'm gonna try them all on and kind of see what the vibes are given because this one is thin so I would have to wear something under here um this one gives Valentine's Day to me as well as kind of like wearing this in maybe like somewhere like St. Lucia or Bora Bora or somewhere like that's what this is giving me like travel vibes but it's out of these three so let me hurry up and try to get ready, girl, because what I like to do is time myself by the GPS. So it say we'll be there at 520 right now. Um, as long as we get there, maybe like 10 minutes before 645, then I'm cool. So this is how I time myself. I'm just going to keep this on to make sure I'm on track. I got my T3 heating up. I think she's done. I'm about to go ahead. They said he want my hair curled. Um, I asked if he want me to crimp it like I've been doing or curl it. So we're going to curl it. And yeah, see how long it takes me. It's 4.23 and I need to do my makeup ASAP. Oh, I don't know, that's 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 that
the way you feel. Must be nice, man. You ain't got a bestow. I can make your bed right. Let me think, I guess it's my turn. Let me put this pussy on your diapers. He's saying bad on a Friday night. Girl, I gotta watch my bed, cause I'm not just anybody. <laughs> so your girl can see and I'm still a baddie period but <laughs> I'm still a baddie so. okay <laughs> 501 prime here at Springs if you're local um really good 10 out of 10 definitely recommend they moved us from the bar and then they moved us to a seat love that um really nice that was the best steak I've tasted his pork chop he said was really good so uh, yeah y'all heard him <laughs> so Definitely recommend. 10 out of 10. And now we're about to go to the casino. We went in, we losing. Man, up and down night. It is 11.29. <laughs> we got an hour drive back down there. 45 or so minutes. I'll get back to 45. <laughs> and I had two readers. I won like $80 twice, played it back, lost. So I'm walking away with nothing. Should have just cashed out my ticket. I ain't even tell you how much I don't <laughs> <laughs> He didn't got up real high though, but he ain't cash out. That shit got going to his head. Cash out, cash out. Yes, whenever you win, Please. cash out. Cash out. He up right now. <laughs> 84 40 tell them cash out yeah i need to cash out now i ain't letting this $60. one go over the Oh, it's close to that big one. I know, you kept getting close. Oh. I'm lit. I'm tired. I'm ready to cuddle. All night. My face is creasing. <laughs> Me? The face is. Look. <laughs> Alright, bye guys. <laughs> Oop, I'm stupid. I still got the cover on. Hey. Hey y'all. It's Thursday, February 15th. They just came in, inspected. <coughs> inspected the apartment. It was like five or six of them in here and I just mopped so I'm gonna have to mop again because they nasty shoes was all up in here. Um, but yeah, they looked at everything. Hopefully she don't think that's paint and she know there's wallpaper on both of them. Um, me and Bae, he about to help me hang up my um, picture frame or a canvas that I painted. This is how it looks. I'll pop the inspo pick up again so you guys can tell me how I did. 
um i was trying to copy it but not copy it too much just kind of get the overall idea of it and i think it turned out cute this one i feel like i kind of went down so i may add some more black paint just coming straight down a little bit more but i like it i like that the i really like this texture spot right here so i think i'm going to make some more like that um but as far as the colors and stuff like that i really like it. i think it turned out nice sorry for all the noise the dishwasher going then they outside putting some more gravel or something out there <laughs> so we're about to hang this up <clears throat> so i'm gonna go ahead and get this out of here can you take that picture off i'm gonna have to put that probably in the hallway did you say hallway mm -hmm. i got a hallway <laughs> he's trying to play with like i ain't got no hallway <laughs> Is this not a hallway? <laughs> Why am I trying to play me? I'm gonna put it right there. You can just leave it right there. Like I ain't got no hallway. I gotta walk through the hall. All right, so. What you're gonna do, you're gonna put tape on the back, right here, right there. And then I'm gonna draw here. Okay, so what I want to go and then put that on the wall. Put tape on the back. Saw this hack like a year or so ago, and then just mark where you want the nail to go. I think I need probably just two, one on each side, right? Let me have this look come back there. Higher, lower? We are right hand down, lower, so. Right hand? Yeah, like the top right down. No, like the one that's behind Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think so. You don't want to open up this. <laughs> Maybe. I think that's fine. Right? Go a little higher. A little higher. That was on backwards. It was on reverse. So I just put it on the charger. Well, it's doing a school job. It's in there for the okay. most part. They always say, we're bad. <laughs> well, some of y'all be asking. Why you won't let your boyfriend do it? He's doing it now. Happy? That man powering now. <laughs> huh? I know. All right, screws in. <laughs> yeah, change the subject. <laughs> All right, I do we do it without this. See the moment of truth. All right, moment of truth. We'll be working with what we working with. Put that thing up there. Watch it say negative one. <laughs> See, I told you. I think it's fine. Yeah, I mean, it looks good to me. It's just negative. Yes. It looks back here. Looks, yes, it looks perfectly fine. Oh, we almost got it by eyeball. Look, 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 look. Period. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now we gotta take that tape off. Nah, cause you trying to steal my little hat. You stole it. You stole it. <laughs> Perfect. This piece tastes still good. <laughs> How it look? Is it giving? Or is it yeah, not? It look good. I'll take a time on you. The little art piece, because you ain't never get your little across the thing. What, the silver thing? Yeah. Yeah, I'm still getting it. Wow. It's going to be silver, so it's going to tie in with my silver chandelier and the silver stuff over there. I painted it that so we can match in with this. And then, y'all know my carpet match with that. And then I am trying to find like a brown tan pillow for these pillows to change them out. But like yeah i think it's cute we'll see saves me 150 200 dollars i can tell you that these two down because they ain't had no water <laughs> it's cool, they still cute. Hey, 
y'all today is friday february 16th 11 41 in the morning i've been up since about like 10 30 10 45 just kind of laying in bed scrolling on social media just checking notifications and stuff that i had while i was sleeping um i'm exhausted <laughs> like i have been i feel like on go and doing so much since these like these two weeks last week and this week i know last week was Bae's birthday and then this week was like valentine's day week so i have drank so much these two weeks and when i say drank so much like my drinking is like a lot of cocktails and <laughs> two shots <laughs> but that is so much more than i ever do like just constantly right after another so um i just feel like i just need my body to just get it together so today i actually switched my shift with um my friend emmanuel he helped me move in he was one of the guys to help me move in um in this apartment last year so he's taking over my shift today and i was supposed to be going to a concert today uh the ashanti and monica and i don't know if there's anybody else only person i care about really is ashanti don't get me wrong i do love monica too but if y'all been following me for a while then ashanti i used to always call her my mom like growing up i used to think i was ashanti do all her stuff her and beyonce fun fact i used to get them mixed up when i was a kid but not anymore obviously but i love ashanti down real bad and i would love to go see her i think the ticket wherever they're sitting is like a hundred like 23 dollars or something but <laughs> I kind of just woke up and felt like I just need to get my life together again. <laughs> like, I've been just having fun on Cloud9 for like two weeks. And I need to get back to my list. Like, just, just my regular routine. So, I'll probably, I'll start that a little bit today. And, let me see. I don't know. Because I'm, I don't know. I'm going to see if they still got a seat by them. Because, like, I want to obviously sit like right next to them i don't want to be like close like i don't know i want to be there with them so i'll see if not i kind of just want to <laughs> stay at home and go to the gym it's 10 44 so i probably won't be at the gym until like 12 30 12 45 because i do need to eat me a little pre-gym workout snack um so i probably cook a couple pieces of bacon i'll eat like some toast or something just like a little bit heavy to be on my stomach while i go work out um haven't been in the gym in about two weeks so i need to work on my content calendar and stuff figure out what's left to do um i am supposed to be launching this version here this week for my brand well next week on the 21st and um bills are coming to my account so i need to look at my budget list and scratch off what's you know already paid coming up just just getting my life together with all of my finances my content stuff gym stuff getting back on track and all of that i haven't even took that bloom yet because life has just been going so fast like i haven't even tried it and then how about me and Bay was in target yesterday and they got bloom like a five or six like little bitty packets that you can just like basically like a tester and i'm like dang i wish i would have saw that because you know what if i don't like it then i could have just used the little bloom packets but yeah if, if you want to try you can go to target and get those little packs it was at the checkout the self-checkout um but yeah last night i kind of started it um i have a transparency post i have two collections on my credit from the dogs from banfield so prints i had owed 89 dollars. this is my little pimple patch if you see that prints i owed 89 dollars left on his little banfield puppy plan and y'all know when i had oreo um i had bought a plan for him as well obviously i know i'm in a contract so if i don't pay it then duh like i know what's gonna happen but i'm like you know at the time it's like girl i don't even got this dog no more stop charging me this money da, da, da. you know how to go so with oreo I owed two like 63 i think was it 263 or 289 i don't know i'm about to look it up but anyways basically the lady was so nice that was the nicest collection company i've ever personally spoke to um the other one that i spoke to before was like in dallas like pro collect or something they are horrible all of their reviews are like a one star like it's really really bad so yeah okay yeah oh 263 so they took off 263 minus i think i'm paying 240 so they took off 23 dollars but i mean it, it's fine i'll take it 
So they gave me the option to pay, um, basically split that in half and pay it by pay it within the next two months. Um, or I could do bi-weekly payments to finish it out. So I'm doing four bi-weekly payments of like $52 to finish it out. So I need to update my budget sheet to reflect on, you know, these little bitty things that's coming out. The $89, I went ahead and paid that. They should be taking it out. I said it for yesterday, but since I called it like 745, I guess they may be in Cali or somewhere because I ain't never had no cost in open that long unless they're 24 hours. Anyway, I paid the $89 that should be taken out by, I'm just going to say by next Monday since it is coming up on the weekend. It's Friday. Um, So yeah, just because that's on my vision board, like, you know, to have my credit score. My credit score when I was in college was, I think the highest I got it to like, it was like 730. So I would like to surpass that and get into like the 800s or like... 790s 780s so that is what i'm trying to surpass and basically get back to and go up so i'm like you know what i put this on my vision board you can't just put stuff on your vision board and then expect it just to magically happen like you gotta work towards it so that's why i went ahead took care of them two little collections take that off they said each one it'll go up by like 23 points I personally know that when a collection goes off, your score will go down before it goes up because it's happened to me before uh, when I was in college. <laughs> so my score went down and then went up. So I'm expecting it to go down, but I would really hope it don't go down too much. But then, you know, I know it'll come right back up. So she said they'll be sending me a letter and stuff for the one I just paid. And then Oreos, of course, that won't be sent out until March. March 28th is my last $52 payment for that. Um, I do have another installment plan going on for something else so just kind of writing down those installment fees and stuff adding that to my monthly budget and obviously my fix and dismisses is already fixed so that's kind of what I plan to do today it is a little gloomy outside it's supposed to rain at like four o'clock and then be very windy so that's why I was like I really want to go to this concert that was on my um bucket list or vision board last year to go to a concert I wanted to do little baby and Chris Brown I think that was last year or was it 2022? That might have been last year. One of the, 2022 or 2023. I went to go to the concert and did it. And girl, it looks so fun. I wish I would have went. So, um, I don't know. We'll see where the day take us. I may end up going. I may not. It don't start till 730. So, it's only 1149. But like I said, I kind of just want to get my life together and figure things out. Okay, so, Dosier just emailed me and here should we do 350 please send me your choices okay so they want to do this is my this might be my third collab with dossier um the perfume absolutely love them uh they was i haven't worked well i just worked with them y'all know but before that it was like a year or so ago and i never responded back to the next collab so they basically pay me a hundred dollars for that and that was like that's what i was charging like whenever i had did that first one so now they're actually i told i sent them two different rates a rate for like a video mention and then like dedicated video so they just they decided to do the um video mention and they're gonna pay me like my actual fee so i'm about to come back and hurry up and pick out my perfumes because maybe i need that money so and, and that's the thing like i know i'm talking a lot but basically how i'm not working today like emmanuel was taking over my shift um the money that i would have made today I'm literally about to get it back right now like well not right now but like you know like next week or so i'm literally about to get that money so of course we get paid every i get paid every two weeks for my actual hospital job so like i said the money that i'm missing out on today at work because i didn't do pto or anything like someone just took my shift so like i don't get no money for today i literally just made it so that's why i just love content creating and stuff like just sitting at home making money and i promise y'all ebook is coming <laughs> i promise y'all i wanted to drop it as well on the 21st when i dropped my virgin hair collection but we'll see how much i can get done because i do got a lot of collabs and stuff to like figure out and like line up so we're gonna talk about it when i get back here and we're gonna get my life together prince is sitting at the door looking at me crazy because we need to go out <laughs> So I'm about to go ahead and take him out, come back, and feed him his farmer's dog. And yeah, I'll talk to y'all soon. My flowers are blooming really, really pretty. These back ones that was hanging down like this have came back up, so they look really, really nice. I'm going to switch out the water. Since I put water in there last night, I'm going to switch out the water for fresh water tomorrow to keep them looking really nice. It is 5.32 in the evening. 
I just got back home and I'm about to unbox my stuff from Target. I went to the gym today. This is the new shirt that I showed y'all probably a couple vlogs back that I got from Amazon. Come in a two pack for like 20 something dollars. I got them to work out in. I mean, you can wear them for anything, but leggings are from Shein as well. But I like the shirts. It's come, they come in a two pack for like $26. Um, fits really nice. Like, I really like them. So I have them linked down below. They'll either, I think they'll either be in gym items or something or like clothes, something like that. They'll be linked down below in something. But yeah, I like them. So from Tarjay, I got some more downy fabric softener because needed some more of that. Along with the fabric softener, I got this little like funnel pour thing. What is this called? A funnel. <laughs> and it was only a dollar at Target little five and below section. So I got this so I can pour it into my new, um, what is it? The new little things that I got from Target, the little pump bottle thing. So got that for that. Um, got some more Glade, what is this, plastic wrap. I really didn't need it, but y'all know I used the Fetch app. And if I spent four more dollars, I was gonna, I'm able to get 1,500 points. So I spent 476 and I got 1,500 points. I'm this close to getting a $50 gift card. I was gonna use the $50 gift card for Amazon, but I'm gonna use it for Ikea now because y'all know I want the Ikea here. I'm gonna pick this up in Target's little five and below section. It just says drink more water. I thought it was just a cute little jug to get. Do I need any more? No. Did I buy it? Yes. This one doesn't come with a straw. I was wanting it to have a straw, but it's fine. I think I wanna start taking this one specifically to the gym. Um, I do have a hydro jug as well, but the hydro jug just, you know, has just so much water. So this is basically like the smaller version of that. So I like how I got the little strap or you can hold it like this. So this from Target, it was $5. I got three pack of macaroni. I needed some more disinfecting wipes and then hygiene purposes. I got some more panty liners. I got two things of wipes. The pink one is gonna go in my guest room because y'all know my guest bathroom has pink in it. And then this one is gonna go in my bathroom because my bathroom, I have like that emerald green going on. So this is the closest thing I can find. Um, I like to keep wipes in both bathrooms. And then I also got the Honey Pot Sensitive. Oops. <laughs> got the Honey Pot Sensitive Intimate Parts and Body Face. pH balance, all of that. Just the 15 little wipes, single wipes. Um, I decided to get these so I can like keep these in my purse. I just started, um, spotting today so we'll see how that goes and i do like to keep some type of little wipe like in my purse or bag or wherever wherever i go so got a 15 pack of these well i guess i guess i got 30 because i got two 15 packs so yeah i'm excited to use these i've never used these before um but i mean i do still use the honeypot products they're perfectly fine to me i know people got mixed reviews about them but i like them so i'm pretty sure i would probably like these as well so y'all know i um while well, I was transitioning Prince to the farmer's dog, he has completely transferred over. He's not getting the hard food anymore. I still have some hard food. So sometimes I just put a few pieces of heart of the hard food in there just so like it can be gone so I don't just completely waste my money. <laughs> but he's been loving the farmer's dog. When I do put the hard food in there, he will eat all the soft food, like the farmer's dog food, and then he will leave <laughs> the kibble. So this is how it looks in the container that they sent. Um, since he's only eight pounds and I feed him twice a day, I, I split in half one of these one fourths. I think that's what it is. And yeah, this is how it looks though. He absolutely loves it. He's standing right here under me, waiting for me to put it in this bowl. And I like it because you can literally see like the real carrots and just everything that they use. So I really like that. And some of them be big chunks like that as well. And I'm feeding him the beef flavor packet one right now.
So right here, I I use a lot of purses <laughs> on the daily, depending on what I'm wearing and how much I want to carry. So I'm using the I'm putting the two little honey pot packages into each purse because I do use like between three purses on a given day. Not a day, but like you know throughout the week. Sometimes I want to take the black purse, sometimes I want to do the brown, sometimes I want to do the tote bag. So I just stocked up my purses and I also stocked up my work backpack that I take to work to put some of these little wipes in there as well. Hey y'all, good morning, it's Saturday. Just wanted to do a little update in closing. It is 2.15 Saturday, February 17th. Um, I'm actually about to go. I'm dressed for work and everything. I'm wearing a t-shirt or whatever tonight. Um, I'm dressed for work because my niece have her fourth birthday party today. It starts at 2 to 4. It is 2.16. Um, my sister stay about 30 minutes away from me. So I'm about to go ahead and head out now. My mom wanted to pick her up, but I'm like, girl, I gotta go to work and stuff. So... I don't know. My battery is about to die, but I just wanted to say thank you guys for tuning in to this week. Um, may not vlog at my sister's uh, house or whatever, so just wanted to say thank you guys for tuning in. I will see you guys in my next weekly vlog. Don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. And to my next one, I will see you lovely soon. Bye, guys.